Look at the derailments that happened on the layout when you came and filmed my setup. Yeah. Could be those damn frickin' air hoses. Hey, Bill, it could be the air hoses, too. Yeah, yeah, that could be snagging. Hey, you ever take my recommendation on that mac and cheese dish over at Papa Gino's yet? No, not yet. You should try it sometime. Oh, yeah, you got the weight on this one. Yep. Okay, we got the weight on the wrong one, but he's that way. I'm going to put a couple more weight on it. All right. That could be the way. I think I'm going to do four more weight in it. Yeah, go ahead. It's yours. Oh, grand. I hope tonight's going to be pretty good for train watching. They're pretty good so far. Oh, hell yeah. He is. What else do you got for engines, if you don't mind me asking? Oh, we got some FD40s. Any uh, GEs? Yeah, I got some white I got to see those in operation. Hmm. FD45. Nice. You okay? Yeah, yeah. yeah and uh, no rush on the number boards on the 801. Yeah. Now, you weather you weather any of your equipment or just leave it the way it is? Usually leave it the way it is. Okay. That's some dirt sometimes works. No, I was just wondering if you got, if you, if you ever darken any radiators on an engine. Oh, on the edge, yeah, I put, you know, I darken up in black and white. Oh, if you want, Phil, you got my permission to darken the radiators yeah. on the 80 Mac. All right. There's some engines I do have that. Now you said you had a what's uh 80 Max? You got Conrail and NS. You got got a Conrail and NS. Okay. I like to do. I like to do is put the two conrails in the uh, CSX one. Yeah, right okay, you could start slowing her down because now, now she's in, in the, uh, in cl it, the uh, the valley. Yeah, yeah. You good? Yep. Whenever you want to stop it, knock yourself out. All right. 